So you came in this morning, and what was kind of what you saw? Yes. Yeah. Well, I realized it. I was like, where's Georgie's? Where's Titanus? Where's the world? <laughs> um, well, this morning, I walked in, and I'm like, where's my painting? And then, <laughs> and then the girl I came in with was like, you're right, where is your painting? When I came in, I thought, oh, MG, where did it go? <laughs> Right. <laughs> okay, what so do you, know, you think? Well, every day in the park, there's always this crazy guy who. <laughs> <laughs> but we have locks on our door, so we know he couldn't come in here. Yeah. Uh, I think someone like, like, cut a part of the roof and then lowered, oh and then and then put and then got a rope, a really really long rope, and like and like someone that was on watch was like fell asleep. Uh oh. How'd you get started, Jordy? Um, we took brown, red, and blue, and we put it into different sections. I heard there's um, po you had to write a little bit of a poem on the side and the borders. And what did you write that you were frustrated with? Um, when my dog takes one of my shoes and starts chewing. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> And how did you get the picture of yourself in there? Um, Miss Limbaugh took pictures of us. And how did you pose for it? Can you show us? What did you guys write around the edges? Did you write a poem? Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, my poem is that I feel frustrated when my mom, I forget my homework and my mom screams. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, hopefully that doesn't happen often. <laughs> my, I will, when I, I was I get frustrated when my mom says stop playing on your iPad to do your homework. No, I'm here with, with Miss Limbaugh, the art teacher, um, that looked over the the painting of these magnificent works, and we came this morning from the other building because we hear that four of them were stolen. So I, we thought that since they were stolen, these must be very great works. So we want to hear about the art process. Uh, the girls went yes, through. the girls worked very hard and diligently on this project. Um, they learned that the background is divided into three sections. So in the upper section, they learned how to do wavy lines. In the middle section, swirly lines. And in the bottom section, diagonal lines. Then uh, we were very careful to work in the same medium that Edvard Munch did, which is pastel on cardboard. I love this because it shows that art doesn't have to be quite so precious all the time. These are common materials available to anybody. The girls had a lot of fun posing in this typical scream pose, which is the most imitated pose probably in art history. Uh, everybody seems to know it from the movie Home Alone, yes. and they did a great job putting this all together into a collection. We're talking with Mr. Giuliano um, to talk about who was in the building when they disappeared. Talk to Miss Spurl um, and Mr. Brown to see if we can remember who exactly was in the building in the morning so we can get to the bottom of it. Some of the girls say that you may be the robber. Um, what, what can you say about that? Oh, well, I'm clearly not the robber because um, in the morning when it disappeared, I was busy um, back to back in meetings. Um, starting at about 7 in the morning, I was at the middle school for a little bit, and I was back here. Um, so it couldn't possibly be um, me who did that. I was just busy all morning, and I was actually the person who noticed that they were gone. I was one of the people. Um, so definitely, um, I had nothing to do with that. And I'm excited to find out who was responsible for it.